You know, the trim button on your throttle is one of the most powerful tools that you have in your boat. I think the general public, especially beginning boaters, think of the trim as only a way in which you can tip your engine up and like navigate through shallow water. Works well for that, but it's so much more. If you trim your, your engine down and tuck it in underneath your boat, when you hit your throttle, it's going to force that bow down. It's like a lever arm. The motor's underneath the boat or the prop's underneath the boat, and then boom, that bow comes down. Especially if you have a lot of people on the boat, you'll get a much better hole shot. Once you're on plane, you might notice that even your nose feels like it's dragging a little bit and there's splash coming off the front. That's when you use the trim exactly the opposite. I start to feather that trim up, basically a little bit at a time, and as you do that, you will feel the nose of the boat coming up. So what that does is by lifting the nose of the boat, it reduces the amount of drag on the hull and your boat will naturally go faster. Let's say, for instance, you're in a choppy situation and everybody in the boat's getting wet. You can lift that nose up by trimming your engine up just slightly so it eliminates some of the spray. You can actually give yourself a smoother ride depending on the wave conditions. So once you get used to using your trim, you'll find out that it's a wonderful tool to completely manipulate the boat to do whatever you want it to do.